Hey guys, um, welcome to another video of Mr. Big uh, Vlogs. Uh, I'm filming this video by myself because uh, my dad said you're really responsible, so I want you to film uh, videos while I'm gone on a trip. So he's on the trip. He left really early this morning. So I just came back from a day of school. Uh, everything's normal right now. I just came back from school. Everything's good. Went inside the house, checked up on the dogs. So right now I'm going to preview because we made a lot of progress. We already started on uh, the benches where you could lay at the bottom and then sit at the top. So we'll, uh, I'll show you that and um, we'll preview the deck because so far he's been doing like a lot of cutting. So there's like a bunch of dust in the garage. But me and, me and my dad, when my dad was here, we used to clean it like with brooms. We used to take the blower. We used to blow it off uh, really good. So right now, I just came back from school. So I'm gonna show you guys how the sun is doing and the deck is doing. All right guys, let's go check out the deck in the sauna. Here's the little deck over here where he's been cutting. So, as I said, there's a lot of dust here. I mean, this, this part over here, that part all the way from this part, I could just easily, like when he's done, like tomorrow after my basketball game, I play for basketball, just so you know, I could like take these wood pieces and then throw them in the bag, throw them in that trash over there. And then here's a saw, and then here on the, on the wood. And this is not the one that we showed you before. This is thicker and it's kind of smooth. So he's been doing that. And this, if there's a lot of dust, I could easily just take the electric blower and blow it off. So let's see what Eddie's doing over here, the sauna. Uh, we're just working on the bench boards tops now. Um, we had to space out certain things. So uh, there was a little bit of trial and error here, but we finally got the pattern down and here we are. So getting going on the correct alignment everywhere. But pretty much here we are. Uh, we're at this point where it is just cut individual pieces and keep going, keep going, building out, building out. So my hope for today is to have bottom bench done. Once, you can once, right once, here. Yeah, so once all these boards are done, you're gonna be able to lay on it. Oh, okay. Sounds good. Go. Yep. All right, guys, just done. Just got done finishing with Eddie, and let's see the garage. And I have a surprise right there for you on the right. I'm not gonna show you yet. But here's the wood pieces that Reed been using over time. But the one that I showed you earlier, it's like uh, kind of like thicker and smooth. Here's the mini truck, as you can see, gonna be into a mini camper soon. As always, oh, my dad, uh, by the way, note, my dad got this gas stain from um, service. He got it all fixed up. As you can see, it looks brand new. What is this for? Oh, this is for the gas traxxas. This is the little, um, I don't know what to call it, but I think it's for I don't know, but it's just a part of the Traxxas. And here's the gas Traxxas. And as you can see, his tank, if you go watch the video back and re-show it, his tank was more rustier, but they added a new tank over here. So we've got the remote. Ooh, this is nice. Look at this, we got the little switch for over here. We got the gas, the turning at the top and then uh, the antenna. So that's situated with, as always. Oh, and guys, we wanted to show you new wheels installed. 
Uh, I know we already um, went over this uh, earlier in the uh, last video, but here's like a full look of the new wheels. They're very thick and they're very, they have good rubber, good grip. And I went uh, test driving on them and uh, they were really like, it was very good on our driveway. So those are good. And these, these are mentally like, we could still use them obviously. We're not gonna like um, throw them away because that's just a waste of wheels, so. And here, here was the box for my dad's remote controller. As you can see, look, here's my dad's remote controller over here. Looks way different. It's got an antenna right here. It's got an antenna right there. And then it's got a red switch right here. But mine, for this car, as you can see, they put blue stickers on it. Mine doesn't have a switch or doesn't have an antenna because mine's electric. His is gas. Like, look, like this costs a lot of money. Like, look, like this is fully self suspension, nice wheels, really a nice wheels, good for mud and off road, full aluminum body. Like, it's metal. So that's what probably makes it expensive. And as always, we got the beast over here, the XRT. Trust me, this will be in more videos. And then we got the, the Traxxas with the light on it, with the uh, kind of like the doom buggy, and then we got the Rustler. So that's a full thing of the garage, and we'll catch you guys later. One eternity later. Good morning, guys. Um, it's the next day. My dad's absent on work today uh, for the whole day, so now I'm filming for him. So we uh, have a carpenter right now working on the chicken coop, and he's doing some work there. But before I show you that, I wanna show you the sauna progress that we've been doing a lot over here in the... He's been working on the benches. He's been working a lot on the impacts. As you can see, there's a lot of batteries some wood pieces and a little bit of dust. And here is the sauna. He's been making a lot of progress. I know it's dark in here, but sorry about that. He's been making a lot of progress on here. And uh, he's been um, drilling stuff. He's been putting together. And right now this is the top and then he's gonna make a layer at the bottom where you could lay down uh, um, when you're using the sauna. So you got the air vat right there. So everything's looking good and then the sauna. Uh, got the walls, got the top, and then got the sides. Cause literally, if you watch our videos earlier, then these walls over here all around, they look like they're not even done yet. Cause in, in the, uh, when we just started the sauna, like this tile wasn't here. Only the uh, the installation was here, that's it. So shout out to you, Eddie, for making all this good work. We hope to see you next week. And let me show you what is uh, what the carpenter is working on. Beautiful weather, a little bit breezy, got the sun. Everything's looking good in the yard. All right, let's go see what the carpenter's uh, working on. Give them fresh water. And then I gave them food. A um, random mixture of food. So they're eating at that right now. There are the goats over there chilling by the chicken coop. And let's go around the chicken coop, see what he's working on. See, he's been working on this thing right here. Look, he's been using some wood. And doing, ah, I like a little pocket to lay their eggs for the chickens. Uh, he's got a little metal thing over there. And he's got some wood. And let's go see you while I'm showing you that. Let's go see if there's any eggs right now. Hey, goat's right there. Okay, let's see. 
see. Nothing there. Nothing there. Oh, we got some eggs right here. Get out of the chicken coop. See, look, it's super bright outside. All right, so that's basically the update of the chicken coop right now. It's being worked on and all the, and the sauna over there in the garage, all the animals are fed. So I'm just gonna continue on my chores now. All right guys, um, chores are done. Everything's taken care of. And um, let's see the results of the chicken coop right now. Cause he basically built like little pockets in the chicken coop. So I'll go show you right now. Look. Oh. Okay. We're just gonna tell this quietly since she's laying over there. So the guy basically, I don't know how to explain it, but he took like a big wood piece and just put it down over here. Cause this was like the old, the old one, like the, it was just wood straight down and this just to lay on. But he put a little pocket over here so they could lay eggs. So he made one, two, three. And then the other one uh, where the little hen is laying. But this is just old, so after they're done laying, they could easily just step over here, go over there, down the little stairs, or they could just fly down. So it's pretty convenient, um, pretty uh, good. And it's very useful because well, it's like very, it's like shade and it's privacy, privacy. And this used to be the old one. So this is just re kind of like put this, like if you saw in like further videos, uh, not further, earlier videos where we like collected eggs, you could see that there was like a lot of hay here, probably like up to here. And we took that hay and then uh, put it up here to make nests. So that's basically the thing for these nests. It's very convenient and um, it's very good for the, oh man, it's bright. Oh, there we go. Sorry, guys. Um, it was just bright outside. So it's very convenient, uh, convenient for the chickens. So they could um, go for them to the chicken coop, and like they could lay their eggs. They could step down, and they could do their business. So that is the result of the chicken coop over there. So that's uh, update on the chicken coop. All right guys, it's kind of weird to do this by myself because my dad always holds the camera, but I'm just gonna have to do it like this. Um, that's basically the update of everything. Everything's good over here. And we're just gonna end the video. Uh, I'm gonna end the video here. Please watch our videos, turn on the notification bell, subscribe, like, and share. God bless your family, and we'll see you later.